Hey guys, welcome back. When we left death, we went for a little wander around the metro with Khan, and quite a lot happened. We encountered some anomaly that just wrecks everything, apparently, humans included, which kind of sucks. I have a feeling that's the dark ones, I'm not gonna lie. And then we also encountered some ghosts. <laughs> yeah. And it's kind of spooky, I'm not gonna lie. Not too spooky for me, though. So I managed to troop on through it. And then we arrived at the cursed station where he wanted us to help out, basically, and he made me do all the work. So yeah, screw that guy. But yeah, now he's abandoned us. <laughs> he clearly used me. And now we're at Armory Station where we're trying to meet a weaponsmith. I can't remember his name, despite the fact that it said it while starting up the game. <laughs> Shows how great my memory is. But apparently he finds us first, according to Artyom's little diary entry. Which has me slightly worried, because I don't know if he's friendly or if he's evil. But if he's a friend of Khan, he's a friend of mine. So all should be fine. Oh! Who goes there? It's just me, don't worry. I'm standing still. It's a human. Kill the light already. Oh no, yeah, it's not well, hard to tell I'm human. <laughs> That's all that counts. Come in, this is a free station. Oh, these seem like nice guys. I was worried this place was going to be all evil, like the last place. Looks fine enough, but they're probably gonna want our help in return for the hospitality, if I had to guess. And are you gonna greet me? Are you the welcoming committee? Careful, kid. Our free station is under the watchful eye of the Reds. Paranoia is the new game in town, so keep yourself below the radar. You understand? Understood, my friend. You look a lot like the other guy at the other station. Just some friendly advice. Yeah, don't worry. I took it to heart. Don't worry. Attention! Attention! Document inspection is currently being carried out at the armory. Please stay at your registered residences and assist the law enforcement personnel in their work. Be vigilant, comrades. The enemy never sleeps. I don't know if it's me being racist about saying this, but I've said this every single time. Everyone seems to sound like Pavel. Like, everyone. And it's kind of scary, because that guy was an asshole. Any loot around here? So I've come to see a weaponsmith. The Where the hell is he? Hello? Lost. Me. Don't swing that <laughs> yeah, he... <laughs> don't want to know what's going on up there. I'm always prepared for this. Oh, we're about to walk in on these guys then. Hush. Yep. And who are you? The comedian's boyfriend! Oh, boy! Put your hands out! You're under arrest! Hey, get off me! What am I doing? I just walked in the room right, and they're like... Right. Saying I did something Lay wrong. Off. I'll come quietly. <laughs> that is not quietly. Okay, let's roll. <laughs> I've already made enemies. Wow, that didn't take long. Nice one. I feel like... Oh, I'm in handcuffs. Yeah, I kind of forgot about that. Yeah, let's just keep running. How... Oh my god, these guys are worse than stormtroopers. Like, come on. It's like in every game ever, though, in every movie. People shoot at you, just cannot hit you for crap. I'm crouching. I can't, like, go prone like you can, though. So, you know, it's a bit unfortunate for me. Okay, I'm going, I'm going, I'm going. I can't run for some reason. The sprint in this game doesn't work very well. Wait up, dude. Flipping, he runs well faster than me. Oh, crap. Did he die? I feel like he died. Because he was lying on the floor then, that guy was just popping shots. Oh, hey. Oh. Yep. Bye. Oh, yes. It's like Mirror's Edge all over again. Oh. Oh, yes. The other guy was meant to me. God left in our world, that day he was with me. I had been rescued by Han's friend, Andrew the Blacksmith. He would prove to be my ticket out of the communist station. How's it going, buddy? But the only way goes through a goddamn battlefield. The front line between the Reich and the Reds. Oh, that sounds great. You'll need a disguise. Take these overalls, put them over your clothes. I'm sure no one will be able to tell. The volunteers to storm the Nazi fortifications. They're about to send a train full of new recruits straight into the fire. But you will be riding the train unannounced. Your seat won't be first class, but you don't have to pay the fare with your own blood either. <laughs> Once the troop train has passed the roadblocks, you're on your own. I never realised I got this far into the game when I originally played it, but I must have got like a good couple of hours in. 
Because I remember this. I remember doing this. Then again, I did play it over and over and over and over again. Restarting every couple of years I came back to it. So yeah, it's no wonder that I remember. And we got to know anyway. I don't think I can even look at that now unless it's in the diary somewhere. Yep, there it is. Note 1. Yep. Mm-hmm. Oh, so this is a lot of pages, this one. Just quickly skim through it. Yep. Mm-hmm. Meaning us, yep. People who... Okay. <laughs> Understood. Okay, so where are we heading? Are we just following this guy for the time being? Can we do any deals with anyone while we're here? Probably not. They don't seem very hospitable of me. For some reason, they wanted to just attack me right off the bat. Oh! Hello, hello, hello. I'll tell you that. Let's rob that guy's ammo. Okay, where do we go from here? Oh yeah, then again, I am in a disguise, so maybe they're not too bothered now. I don't like that guy, though. Oh, yes. You look like the guy with the weapons. Ah, yes. Yep, I'm going to hone my arsenal, indeed. Don't you worry about it. Okay, so we can get flipping like ridiculous sights now. A reflex might not be bad and it does look pretty badass. But I think we want to save our cash and pimp out our other weapons. Okay, yeah, so we don't really have much say in what we have on this. But we can add that back because that would be very nice. And there we go, it's back to its usual self. As for the AK though, there's still stuff we can do to this because we haven't done anything to it yet. So, a silencer could be nice. I don't see why we need one though. Um, may as well, it's cheap. May as well take it. As for a sight, we could do with... An IR one might be useful, just in case. But then again, if we're in the dark, we're going to be using the Magnum anyway. So I will take that. And there we go. Speaking of the Magnum, I might put the IR sight on the... Oh, what? We can actually switch some weapons out. Completely forgot about the other weapons in this game. Because there are a lot of nice weapons. Especially the shotguns. For you. Just buy and shoot. Oh, I wish I'd looked at these before I started making things. So which is the most... That's a shotgun. But that is a more expensive shotgun. So I have a feeling this is the best shotgun in the game. So I'm going to take it. Don't want to trade it with my revolver. I would like to keep my revolver. I'll trade it in with this. Where is it? There it is. Okay. Take it. I'm putting my faith in this gun. Hopefully it's good. Hopefully it was worth the flipping price. Um, should we just put a sight on it anyway for the hell of it? Because it's got to be better than the iron sights. Obviously take the extended barrel. Because we're not going to be rushing anyone with a shotgun and a silence that. There we go. We'll give this a try. If it doesn't go too well, we'll take the thingy back. Now where did the blacksmith go? Oh, there he is. Hey buddy, wait up. It's okay guys. He's with us. Yeah, I'm a good guy, trust me. Come on, jump into the hole up to him. This hole. Okay, I'm getting in. Hoot. There's some notes down here. Let me read them before we go. Hmm, yes. Andrew the blacksmith is a nice guy, apparently. Oh god. A load of guys that are gonna get absolutely obliterated. Now just push that thing over me, guys. And I'll get going. Guys, you're gonna Push it over before someone comes, or do I have to crouch? Oh no, probably turn the light off. Oh, maybe not. Okay, it's going under. I feel like someone crossing the border illegally. I don't know why. Am I going to slip in there, or am I just going to hold on to one of these? Oh, crap. Okay. <laughs> not exactly hidden. You see that luggage hold? Ah, so I'm going to crawl in this area. Cool. Ah, there's a little book down here and everything for me to read. Oh, look what book it just happens to be. So, what do you guys think? Let's go, huh? Poor guys. I feel really sorry for the people that are about to ride this and get absolutely obliterated. Damn. My neck must be really long. If that's where my shoulder is all the way back there, my neck must be increasingly long. Is it really safe in there? I wouldn't like to see him. Down onto the rails. I'm be fine. I fell down before. No first class carriage. But he's good as dead if he stays. If we go straight to the Bianca, and that's a one way ticket. To what? To death. 
<laughs> Great. Okay. Okay, pick it up. Oh, so all them guys doing pushings. Oh god, what? Where are we going? We've got all those guys doing push-ups are basically going to get in this thing. I feel so sorry for them. What a name! Sergei Sergeyevich. <laughs> Jesus, that's a weird name. Q people having that name in real life getting really angry at me. <laughs> But what you don't know, person that sounds like Pavel, I'm already riding this thing. Oh god, we're going down onto the tracks. Look at all them poor souls. Not knowing what's going to actually happen as soon as they get on this thing. How can they not see me? I'm barely hidden. Like, come on. Maybe from the sides I'm a bit hidden. From the back. Okay, I'm pretty low down actually. Maybe I'll be okay. Oh. <laughs> Luckily no one's spotted me. Are they above me yet? Are they hopped on? I can't really tell. It doesn't look like it. Yep, they're getting in. I can't really see their feet though. And again, I am at right at the end of it. But it sounded like everyone was like right there. I guess not. Jeez. Did you join the army? I followed my political beliefs. As for me, I'm here for the doll. How about you? Me? Join the army, they said. See the world, they said. Huh? <laughs> See what was world? A army soldier, and his father as well. It's the family tradition. Oh, Jesus Christ, I'm pretty fast. Is it also your tradition to lose arms and legs on the battlefield? They were happy to make those sacrifices. <laughs> sure. Drunks and fools are happy too. There is a black got a point. capsule in my ammo pouch. What is that? An antibiotic? No. It's cyanide, in case the enemy captures you. Jeez. But, God forbid suicide. I'd go straight to hell. Really? Listen, boy. A Nazi prisoner is going to hell anyway. Trust me, the pill is faster. I could never take my own life. Then give me your pill. I'd rather swallow two than rot in one of their stalags. Got a point. Even the apocalypse didn't stop us from killing one another over ideology. I was about to go through the front line between the Nazis and the communists. I heard they once fought another war. But the Nazis lost. Yes. The music in this game is so cool. It's so weird, but so cool for the same. Oh god. This music, however, not so cool because they sound like a bunch of crazy people. Granted, I have no idea what they're saying, though. They could be singing something really good. Oh god! What the hell happened? Oh, okay. So, what they said was going to happen actually happened. Oh, then again, they're all about to get shot, so I'd rather not be there when that happens. Damn, is this my flipping. Is this my AK? It looks way different to what it did. Oh no, this is that new shotgun I bought, ain't it? Interesting. It's got more rounds in it though, that's what I'm happy about. There's my AK, okay, okay. Let's roll. Make sure my light isn't on. Don't know how I couldn't tell anyway. Are they always already getting shot to death? Are they about to get absolutely wrecked? Well, no one's getting killed just yet. But then again, Everyone's hostile here to me, so I just need to keep on my toes and keep moving. That's what the F that was, my friend. No need to swear about it. <laughs> Talk about getting wrecked. I didn't even realise that guy was there, and I began to panic as soon as I shot that one guy and I saw that other guy was there, but I was like, yeah. You know what, I'll just kill him too. <laughs> no remorse. And he swore too, that was extremely rude. He shouldn't do that when someone dies. God. Okay. I'm worried about going to the lights because the enemies in this game are not exactly forgiven when it comes to spotting you. Who 
Hey, guess what? He's not going anywhere. Damn, I'll just karate chop that effort to the back. Get wrecked. Hey, buddy, you were right, yeah? I saved your bacon. Remember that. If you see me later, remember you only. Okay, is that someone going up? It did look like someone heading up. So perhaps they'll come back down. I don't know. Is there anyone down here with me at the moment? Does not look like it. Hey comrades, have you heard what happened yesterday? What happened? I was there and only got my head blown off. Damn. I have a nightmare for the rest of my life. I had a nightmare. Can I sneak under this? I'm trying to be really what sneaky, happened? but I feel like I'm gonna get seen no, anyway. I think there's gonna be a gun fight here. I don't think there's any way around there. How many guys are there up here? <laughs> then again, I am in the dark, so they can't actually see me. So I'll sneak around here. Ooh. Oh god, people are asleep. Let's keep it that way. Can we, like, knock them out while they're asleep? I can shoot them in the dick. That won't make much of a difference. <laughs> Unfortunately. Guys, don't die if you shoot them in the dick. As much as popular belief would have you think. Okay, a key, a key. I'm glad keys glow red. It's unusual, but it's good, I guess. Don't want to flick that just yet. Yeah, I do, because I'm about to head down into it. <laughs> okay, switch off the electricity. Should be safe to navigate now. And hopefully, something worth is actually down here. Hopefully, it isn't just a scare. Oh. It did just save. Uh, is that me breathing? Oh, yeah, it is. I need to pop that on then. Jesus, it's nearly broke. I feel like something's in the water. It's slightly worrying. This water is very deep. Okay, maybe it's not. <laughs> Please, no scares. No scares? Good game. Slightly worried though about this. Oh, it's so like just in the view of something's gonna freaking happen. Oh, no. Oh, night vision goggles. Nice. Wounded if you didn't come down here and find them. I'm scared. I don't know that noise. <laughs> I don't know why it scares me so much when I hear noises that like it, it is like it is scary. Hearing noises that you can't see like see where it's coming from is slightly worrying. Like I'm not overreacting about that, am I? I don't know. I feel like something's behind me. Because I got flipping surround headphones on, surround sound, it's like kind of spooky, but I'm just gonna leave. <laughs> there we go. Everything's alright for the time being. Probably won't be once we head back out here, though. Back into the flipping firing range. Okay. So, yeah. We'll try and sneak past all these assholes in the next episode. Probably won't go well, so don't get too excited. But, yeah. <laughs> As always, guys, I hope you've enjoyed. Thanks for watching, and I'll see you up.